everyone, it's Monica. Welcome back to my channel. It's been a while since my last TOEFL related video, but I have returned with new TOEFL content, starting with essential TOEFL vocabulary broken down into subject categories. Today, I will be sharing essential vocabulary for animal related passages on the TOEFL exam. Now, TOEFL loves animals, from majestic dinosaurs to microorganisms, and there are a variety of academic subjects that deal with animal-related topics on the TOEFL exam, including zoology, biology, marine biology, conservation biology, ecology, environmental science, archaeology, and paleontology. When it comes to animal-related passages on the TOEFL exam, one of the most popular topics is animal adaptation. To adapt means to change in order to suit a condition or an environment. In other words, to adapt to something means to adjust to something, to accommodate something, or to become accustomed to something. So an adaptation refers to a change over time that allows a living thing to survive in a particular environment. Give an example. One of the most common animal adaptation is called camouflage, which is the ability of an animal or plant to prevent itself from being seen by blending in with its natural environment. In other words, to camouflage can mean to hide, to cover, to mask, to cloak, to disguise, or to conceal. Animals that are masters of disguise include some species of frogs, toads, geckos, caterpillars, owls, and snow leopards, all of which have the ability to blend into their environment with their unique colors, shapes, and or patterns. Other common adaptations include migration, hibernation, resource conservation, and insulation. Migration refers to the process of animals traveling to different locations, usually due to seasonal changes. An adaptation seen most commonly in birds. Hibernation refers to the state of being inactive or asleep, usually during wintertime. Animals most known for hibernation are bears and bats. Resource conservation refers to the management of natural resources like water for maximum benefit. For example, camels conserve fat and water in order to survive in deserts where food and water are scarce. Finally, insulation refers to the act of covering something in order to prevent heat from escaping or entering. Many animals have thick fur or hair that cover their bodies to help them survive in extreme cold, such as polar bears. There are, of course, countless types of animal adaptations, some of which are extremely unique. Now, this is a very popular topic on the TOEFL exam, so add these basic vocabulary to your essential TOEFL vocabulary list. Let's review. The most common animal-related topic is adaptation. Adaptation. Another way to say to adapt would be to suit, to adjust, to accommodate, and to become accustomed. Common types of animal adaptation include camouflage, migration, hibernation, resource conservation, and insulation. Words related to camouflage. To camouflage. To blend in or to blend into. To hide. To cover. To mask. To cloak to disguise, to conceal. Okay, that's it for today. Remember to subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss out on any other TOEFL related videos coming in the future. And of course, if there are any other TOEFL related topics that you would like me to cover, please leave them in the comments below. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.